Use the plastic tweezers to remove the coaxial cable. Remove the two screws from the PCBA and six screws from the subsidiary board. Remove the B2B connector steel sheets from both ends of the main FPC. Remove the battery B2B connector and main FPC B2B connector from the subsidiary board. Use the plastic tweezers to pry up the speaker from its lower left corner and take the speaker out. Slightly rotate the subsidiary board from the position of the USB port and remove the subsidiary board. Remove the adhesive from the front cover and speaker. Prepare a new subsidiary board and remove the microphone mylar. Align the subsidiary board with the positioning rod. Insert the top of the subsidiary board obliquely into the buckle on the upper left corner. Hold the right side of the subsidiary board. Rotate and insert the subsidiary board into the metal buckle. Press the right side of the subsidiary board to ensure that it is installed properly. Take a speaker and align the lower right corner of the speaker with the positioning rod on the front cover. Install the speaker in place. Secure one main FPC B2B connector to the subsidiary board and then secure the battery B2B connector. Install the steel sheets at both ends of the main FPC. Fasten the two screws on the PCBA and six screws on the subsidiary board in the sequence shown in the figure. Then attach a warranty label. Take a new coaxial cable and install it to the corresponding position on the front cover. The installation of subsidiary board is complete.